Hello, nerds and geeks, and welcome back to Tazpia's Toys. Uh, yes, um, it's T A Z P A Z Toys T O Y T O Y Z. Uh, <laughs> I like the Z. Um, but now this one is such a big no. Uh, today's video is the Star Wars Black Series Darth Vader helmet. This one is such a big box that uh, I had to take, oh, I was going to need two AAA batteries. I don't have, not right now, I, have, I think they're downstairs, uh, but uh, anyway, that or um, I had a bunch of batteries. Double A? No? Yeah? Maybe? Looks like I have a bunch of double A's. Uh, well, I'll take care of... Ooh, good. I will take care of uh, getting the batteries in a jump cut. Probably once I open the sucker. Uh, but yes, it is the Star Wars Black Series Darth Vader Electronic Helmet Multi Piece Magnetic Assembly uh, Sound Effects Helmet. So, and it's such a big box, I couldn't set it up the way I did my previous two uh, toy reviews. So, this should be fun. Let me just get the knife real fast. Right. Ah, here's one. Okay. Get the knife. And we're going to open the tape on it. And I am opening the tape for the first time. Alright. Now let's see what this sucker looks like. Alright, so we're gonna open it up now I'm opening it up to look at it uh, and I'll probably end up going back in the box at least for storage but seeing as how it's a helmet which I have two that I will be reviewing for this as well um, okay This sucker. Oh, it's like that, is it? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, so here is one piece. Just the top piece. Okay. With me so far? Because there's that top piece. Here is something and oh okay it's the stand so that I can put it and have it so it may not go back in the box but it might for now but like it may not stay in the box forever all right let's see You've tied it to this box, or is that just looks feels like just a packing safety box? Oh, my word! And it's actually wearable. Oh, 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 oh. 
Hi, Blake. What? Yeah, this is Blake. I have two cats, Blake and Lucky. And this is Blake. He's a good kitty cat. You're a good kitty. Alright. So, isn't it pretty? It is so pretty. So, now it fell. Alright, now to cut the holdy straps that are on it carefully, or at least make so I can untangle them. Of leg. Okay. Oops. Did you see that? She just jumped into the box. They love boxes. I just knocked over. No, oh, that's not Power Ranger. What was it? I just knocked over. Alright, time to just cut, I guess. doing she's do you see her do you, do you see this one she thinks the, the box is hers just because she jumped in it oh is it pretty all right glasses off because Try to This is definitely gonna be one of those stick it on a shelf and don't wear it except for occasionally once. Hey! Don't dig at the box. If you're gonna play in the box, play in the box. If not, don't dig at it. Please, I need the box. Ah. Off you go. All right. Okay. It's definitely a tight fit. Especially on my cheekbones. Right. I don't even have... Oh, I better put on a... Uh, cover like I do with the... Uh, White Ranger helmet. Hey, don't push the box off, girl! What are you trying to do? Huh? What are you trying to do? Where did I put the black face mask? Ah, oh, here it is. Let me put this on like I do with the White Ranger. Hey! Don't eat the box! Don't eat the box! And no, I didn't hurt her, I just tapped her. Like, that. Just to, you know, hey. So she's fine. I will not hurt my own pet. I'm not that kind of person. I love my kitties. Alright. Even if they were being bad, I wouldn't hurt them. Okay. So there's that. Hair is now taken care of by this thing here.
Oh yeah, definitely a where occasionally and not very often thing. Just getting the sucker on is a a pain. Like it's definitely a task, like a two-person task. Especially since I have such a big head. I think I can do this though. Come on. I want to wear this sucker. Maybe if I can get a Darth Vader costume, I'll have a mask to wear. Anyway, uh, let's just leave that. Undone for now because for whatever reason it won't. Oh, there we go. Hopefully, it'll be a lot easier taking off than putting on. Yeah. All right. Oh, yeah, that's not going anywhere. That's not. That's not coming off. That's not. Uh, it's not going anywhere. Like, I'm moving to my head. No, it's not. That's not going to come off. Okay. Like, the star little one is a little loose. So it shifts on me. Uh-uh, not this one. And the eyes are barely fogging up, too. This would make a great face shield. Ha, 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 ha. Now I just need the batteries, and oh, would this be fun. <laughs> uh, oh, could you, s I could totally see wa going around, walking around Walmart, dressed in all black, have a cape, wearing this. Da -da 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 it is a little heavy, though, I will admit. Uh, this is probably going to be the longest Taz toys so far, but uh, I will admit this is definitely... A heavy object to have on my head and I will not be wearing it very often but it is definitely well worth the money for it if you can avoid it do not underestimate the power of the dark side if I find a inexpensive Darth Vader costume I am getting it and then wearing this instead of the little plastic mask I'm wearing this sucker the costume might be Halloween might be a Halloween costume cosplay but this sucker this sucker is totally worth it look at that the, it is really heavy especially right here on the cheekbones on the chin is where it hurts the most is where it actually kind of hurts but it is definitely worth it. Uh, that just magnetically pops off. Just set it. All right, now let's see if I can get this thing off. And the fact that you guys can kind of sort of hear me through, or at least what OBS is saying, is actually pretty good. All right. Uh, so there's the neck piece. So it is definitely a two-person put-on job. So get that next piece, and then uh, and the sounds are right there. Definitely need to go f get the uh, AAA batteries to see how this sucker, what the sucker does when it lights up and plays sounds. So. I will be I will be right back all right I'm back <laughs> teleportation don't you love it batteries two or three of them depending on how many I need now, screwdriver, I believe, 
Should have one or two. Right about. That's a flathead. Uh, let's see. Uh, that's another flathead. That should work. Let's see what this sucker does. Okay, so I have to just use the knife. Tip. There we go. And I'm not using the actual knife itself. I'm using the bottom of it. That basically was made do stuff like this, or at least similar. Almost got it. All right, there we go. I just need to put one minus side up, one plus side up. Put this back, and it shall be done. during Corona now wearing this sucker. It'll be heavy for sure. And you know, my glasses will make it, or not being able to wear my glasses will make it a little hard to see. Anytime I'm going to the store for another Taz PA Toys, uh, you know, something to go get to review, I'm wearing this sucker. All right, let's see. On switch. Okay, let's see. Oh. I thought I did it that way. Okay. Did that. Okay, so I should just. Does it have to be all the way on before it'll start working, or? Let me double check that I put the batteries in right. Minus that way, minus up, plus up, that's what I did. Guess I need to fully put it on? Once the batteries are dead. Because there's not even a switch in here, there's no switch anywhere else. There's no mention of a switch on the instructions. It just says put batteries in. So I guess you need to put it all together first before it'll make plates and sounds. But Start putting this sucker on again and uh, seeing if I have to have it. All together before I can get. 
plates and sounds. Here's Here's the tough part. Okay. So let's put one side on before I Get them on. So it goes this way. Yes, that would make it putting on a little easier, I guess. So yeah, if I put it all the right way, it takes one person. So then, take this sucker. Put it on like that. And then, the, I'm pushing the button, nothing. There's, there's no, there's no switch. There's no mention of a switch. It's just, it mentions a stand. Oh, here we go. Uh, collar. Okay, collar on. Hit button. Okay. Uh, attach collar as shown. No, adjust it in front of mirror. For best results, press button when mask is not attached. Not attached for sound effect. Put on mask. Wait, there's actually a button here. So I actually, hold on. I need to pull this thing apart and look at it better. Ugh. This is working. It's just. So, apparently, this part, uh, uh, apparently, this goes on first. Not attached for sound effects. It's not attached. So why is it not? All right. Remove air vent for supplemental ventilation. event you're talking about. I found something now. Uh, oh, so remove this piece if I want to breathe a little bit better. But that actually was fine, surprisingly. So, what's it? Uh, there for now. I do want to figure out what why this part won't. Is there a button? Is there? Because it just says use Phillips crosshead screwdriver not included. Two AAA batteries. I put them in the right way. I screwed them in. Other than that, it does say nothing. Um, 
Lift color to attach magnets. Helmet seals seal sound effect will play when mask is attached. Use strap to adjust fit. Press button for ventilation sound effect. When mask is removed, mask removal sound effects will be triggered. When mask is attached, connect magnetized helmet as shown. And then it talks about the stand. Other than that, it does not say why it's not working. So if I've got that attached. I've got just this. No, no sound effect. I am pushing the button, but no sound effect. Ah. It's actually really cool the fact that it separates into three different pieces. Or technically four pieces, I guess you could say. I'm guessing the batteries were dead. Anything up here that would use AAA? So without going to go buy brand new AAA, I don't think I have any way of placing with the, with the AAAs I know work. And nothing is open at the time I'm recording this, so it's one of those. I guess I will have to redo this at a later date um or at least at least the sound effect part because uh, this uses one double a tv remote uses two double a's camera uses four double a's xbox controller uses two double a's nothing i know of uses Nothing I have up here uses triple A's. So it's not even like a, oh, I can take it out of this and except maybe. What do you use? Double or triple? use triple A's, I am borrowing them. If you use double A's, I will just close you back. You use double. Okay. What does my Yu-Gi-Oh! GX dual disc use? Now I'm just trying to figure out, you know, a way to get this thing to work. Because the triple A's that I did have aren't working, so I'm guessing it's the triple A's. Um, and I just knocked over the Star Lord pop figure I had. Oh well. Let me see what batteries this uses. Oh, wait, 
this is a 16th one. So these aren't gonna work. These are those little watch batteries. Yeah, that's not gonna. That's not gonna do me any good. Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Dual Disc. If anybody wants me to do a video on that, I totally will. I don't have anything up here at the moment that uses AAA batteries. So I have nothing that I can take from. And the batteries I got before aren't working. I can try a different one. Because it says minus up on one, uh, plus up, minus up, plus up. See, I got it the way that it says, and then uh, I'm gonna put. I'm gonna test the button before I even. Got it to work. Okay. Just screw. Now let's try this again, shall we? Now that we got it to work. easier to get it on like this than it was with all of it. Okay. Okay. Uh, what I'll actually do is turn this to be facing me too. That way you can get a slightly closer look while I put this on. So you can get the far away look and the closer look. something blocking it somewhere. Oh yeah, I just don't know. Wait, no. Okay. Ho, 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 ho. Let's see, I can't adjust this. I just need to pull it down, I think. Tighten it. Because it's like not quite tight enough on the base of the head. So I just need to. And then if I take this, put it on like and then and I can even I guess it's only when the 
guess it's only when it's separated, but you can even take the breathing piece out of here for better ventilation if I wanted. Again, it's still pretty heavy, but uh, it would definitely be interesting to uh, go around Walmart or cons or anything wearing this because it, perfect for Corona. I know I just pulled a uh, Ask a Ninja, but yeah, it, this is perfect for Corona. If I took out the uh, little mesh part, it would probably even be able to breathe better without fogging up the, the lenses. As it is, I'm barely fogging them up, but yeah. This is really good, actually. And then fight. Keep that off. Set it over there. Like, it's mostly... Without that cover, you can f I can feel the back of my head. So it's not a 360 helmet without that, but it still works. Okay, so now... Just need to it should just Well, apparently I'm Darth Vader now. That is terrifying. It looks like a weird jaw. Looks like I'm an animatronic. I'ma eat ya. <laughs> Definitely want to wear this to like Walmart or Spirit of Halloween or something. Just wear all black and then this. Or find a Walmart uh, Halloween costume or like Darth Vader Halloween costume and then wear this. Totally want to do that now. But then I can just take this piece off here before attaching it back that and this then this piece here is a stand piece which I don't know where I'm gonna stick it but I'm like for now I'm probably gonna stick it back in the box but it's going to be one piece rather than being the several different pieces that it was. So this will actually go... How do they show it in... Oh, it help if I put it in the bottom. So it'll go like this. Just to kind of help it stand. Yeah. That is... This was definitely worth the money, because now if all I need is a Darth Vader costume, and uh, I got Darth Vader cosplay. Now, I will say that there will be um, two more helmet reviews until, uh, or there will be probably four more helmet reviews. Um, at least for now. Uh, like a grand total of four more. Uh, I know of four helmets that uh, I can review. The Star Lord that you guys saw, the White Tiger from the past two reviews, and then I'm getting two more helmets in October that I will probably re be reviewing, just like I reviewed this one. Um, overall, like I spent. Or will spend a hundred and fifteen dollars on this helmet. I will say, worth it. Definitely worth it, especially with Corona right now. Yeah, I would. I want to wear this. 
at work. Uh, just walk around work wearing this. If it weren't so heavy, if it were a little lighter, but it for what it is, it heaviness is actually good. Um, but yeah, it looks like a decapitated Darth Vader right now. <laughs> Plus, I did just get that Walmart lightsaber that lights up when you. <laughs> Oh boy, I guess I am supposed to be Darth Vader for Halloween or something. Uh, I just need to find a costume. Oh, because I uh, another video that I'm gonna start doing, and I know this is a longer 40 minute video, so I'll probably figure out a way of chopping it down. But uh, the another video I'm gonna be trying. Oh, I'll explain any. Uh, channel announcement trailer uh video all right guys i'll see you all next time on taz pa toys uh next time we'll probably be reviewing a uh this time we reviewed a sith lord or a darth lord next time we'll probably be reviewing a star lord see you all next time bye